Hello everyone, I hope everyone is doing well. Today I came up with another video on Infosys SP role coding before interview plus technical interview experience, right? Before going into the video, if you are new to the channel, please do subscribe, share and like my videos. If already a subscriber, please hit a like so that it motivates me to do more and more videos for you. It is the ratio between subscribed and not subscribed people. Consider subscribing if you feel these videos are worthy. Without any delay, let us see the questions. TR questions, there might be chances of coding round before the interview. Okay. And uh, few students faced this. Okay. I have extracted the information from the students. Few students faced the uh, coding round before their interview. Right. And pre-coding questions consists of these questions mainly these questions bit manipulation routing uh, routing oranges and dfs in graph and longest common subsequences okay these are the repeating questions and there are other questions also but it is these are the most common questions which are asked in uh, pre-coding round and i have also shared a few information in my previous videos and the links are available in comment section right and they're also asking if you are from ml and web development they're asking define key terms related to machine learning and react js and uh, write a query to find fifth highest salary in database table i have already given the answer for this uh, question in my previous videos all the links available in the comment section and project discussion about your projects okay what is the unique feature of your project what difficulties did you face during your project and how do you overcome those difficulties right see during the interview the interviewer will know everything about you based on your resume and your intro, intro within two to three minutes right your entire 22 years of journey educational journey should be introduced in two to three minutes right so your self introduction should be very effective so that the interviewer should attract to your uh, sentences or your word formations or your self intro right so explain yourself about your projects as well and make sure your projects are uh, minimum two to three not more than uh, two or uh, four to five like that because you should uh, keep the projects in for so that the interviewer should attract it to that project and you should be able to explain about the project everything what is your role in projects what technologies have you used if you want to implement the project further how do you implement your project in that way so have a complete idea on your projects make sure your resume is worthy enough and uh, it, it, it is simple and you should be able to answer to every question if they ask it from your resume right okay and technologies you are passionate about exploring in future and theoretical concepts algorithms oops and operating systems basics of data structure algorithms and concepts mentioned in your resume oops basics abstract final interfaces functions and data structures sql dml ddl joins a subquery normalization transactions no sql and mangodb deadlocks their prevention and handling mechanisms object oriented concepts inheritance polymorphism and encapsulation right maximum students are facing uh, paging paging from uh, operating system also they are facing and virtualization concepts also they are facing so have a good idea and have a complete idea on oops and their definitions and if they want to if they asked you to write a pseudo code you should be able to write a pseudo code on encapsulation or inheritance okay types of inheritance how do you implement the abstract keyword and learn about the keywords super keyword final finally and um, static keyword where do you use uh, where, can we override or uh, overload the static or not okay in that way learn different type of things because you should be capable of answering any type of question that that the interviewer asks you but make sure your resume 
it consists of uh, two to three projects and you should be aware of those projects right if you want have a screenshot and what is bcnf and what is 3nf it, these are from dbms questions and what are cpu scheduling its and its types deadlock prevention of deadlock multi multi threading concept binary tree traversal swap two numbers without the third variable it is a tr question during the interview he asked uh, the boy that means the student and hash map related questions i have told you many videos about the hash map learn about the format of the hash map working of hash map and learn at least one code using hash map and make sure you have a lead code profile and they are also asking you what are the problems have you solved in lead code hard medium and simple questions and asking you to solve okay what is the difference between function overloading and function overriding anagram related question is also asking during the interview for the sp role students okay so make sure you are preparing well and the process scheduling algorithms from os and reverse the linked list what is deadlock in os and how do you overcome what are joins in dbms left join right join and inner join are very much important and their difference okay and you should able to write the sql query using them dbms os cn sql and usql desa are the topics the questions which are occurring okay you see if you are uh, good with the computer networks you have a good idea on ip addresses uh, tcp udp protocols and uh, three um, four way handshake everything okay and os layer os uh, osi layers um, everything also okay dbms normalization okay sql queries have a complete idea just go through it because uh, up to, uh, uh, you may have plenty of time before your mail schedules right so learn each and every topic in a day okay can you elaborate on the projects you have worked on see they will ask more questions on your projects where uh, there is a chance where you can hold your interviewer questions through your projects okay if your projects attracted the interviewer he will focus directly uh, turns on your projects itself so then there will be less time for asking the questions on dbms os cn sql and dsa right so there will be uh, more questions on your projects so make sure you have a good projects and you should have idea on it and technologies everything linked list queue backtracking trees are the most recurring sub uh, questions okay have a complete idea on the traversal of binary tree merge and quick sort algorithms time complexity is also very important and you should able to write the pseudo codes okay software engineering questions at least one question is repeating on software engineering like uh, software development life cycle i have already told you in many more videos that software developing cycle is very much important for a software engineer because he should able to know how to deal with the customer from the uh, work starting to the finishing of the project suppose if you are handling a project then you should have a complete idea where to start when when to stop and what steps to be taken what next what next everything will be in the software development cycle so the steps should be known so that is why software engineering is very much important i have already told you many students are facing questions from virtualization and paging from the os okay have a good idea on them if you want have a screenshot right and os layers os coming to the os layers you should know what are the layers what are the functionalities and how do they work okay everything have a complete idea on uh, os layers if you feel these videos are worthy please do subscribe share and like my videos and share with your friends and family too okay if you want have a screenshot i hope you have a complete idea on that uh, see uh, pre coding round before the interview it is not mandatory but few students are facing that i am also seeing comments from the students and in my telegram channel also they are asking that is why i made video and i have collected uh, questions from the students make sure you are preparing well all the best for your interviews have a good uh, interview with the interviewer right all the best thank you so much